Hey, I'm Lino Ruli, author of the book Saint, Why I Should Be Canonized Right Away. I'm here answering your questions all about sainthood. What's on your mind? Why is John Paul II your go-to saint? Uh, John Paul II. So, you know, uh, I grew up in the late 70s, early 80s. This is the only pope I ever knew. Uh, I'm Italian, so whenever I'd go and visit my family in Rome, I'd see my aunt, my uncle, my cousins, and I'd go see my grandfather, if you will, in the spiritual sense, John Paul II. So growing up, this was always the pope that I knew. And then in the late 90s, I had a chance to meet him, in fact. And uh, although I embarrassed myself, like I do in most ways, when I met John Paul II, uh, I, I went down to kiss his ring, and I, I, I have a s slightly larger nose than some people, and uh, instead of kissing the ring, my nose bumped into the ring, and when I looked up to him to see him sort of smiling and laughing at me, you think to yourself, well, how often in life do you have a saint laugh at you? That should be my reason for canonization as well, you know. However, uh, I love John Paul II because in many ways, he reminds me that heaven is real. I've got a picture on my wall of that day I got to meet John Paul II. And as a friend of mine always points out, or when John Paul II was alive, he said, oh, I bet, uh, I bet the Pope doesn't have that picture uh, on his wall. <laughs> Thank you, I, I know. But uh, to this day, whenever I look at that picture, so there it is, me and him. Now he's dead, and the church is canonizing him. The church has said he is a saint. Well, that means heaven is real. So whereas we can think of the saints of centuries ago, or the first century for that matter, those aren't men or women that I ever met, that I ever shook hands with. Those aren't men or women who laughed at me, quite frankly. So I've got a great devotion to John Paul II because he's a reminder to me, and hopefully to all of us, what this life is really all about, that it's not about just here on earth, that the goal is heaven, and that heaven is attainable. Somebody we all knew, somebody I met, is in heaven. When the church canonizes John Paul II and says he's in heaven, I go, wow, it's a real place. It's so much more real. So uh, I've got that devotion to John Paul II because he laughed at me and because I hope to see him again uh, there in heaven once I become a saint. So I'm Lino Ruli, author of the book Saint, Why I Should Be Canonized Right Away.